Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a very special unboxing and it's here. I literally got this package a hour ago and it's an Hermes bag and it's either a Hermes Birkin or a Kelly. Full disclosure guys, this is a pre-love handbag, but I could not say no. It wasn't on my wish list, no, but once you see this bag, I think you guys will understand. I couldn't resist it. Yes, it's gonna totally go with the, the wall of neutrals over there, and I'm so excited. And y'all are gonna see this live because I don't, I haven't seen it yet. And I will be taking it to Baba Baby for authentication. So I will let you know how that goes as well. Anywho, this bag was something that a couple days ago I text my handbag buddies, Caleb and Quirky, at like 4.45, 5 o'clock in the morning, just saying about this handbag, and decided to purchase it. So we're gonna see how this bag goes. Look at this. This is a beautiful Kelly <laughs> in a size 28. It's beautiful. It's a vintage box Kelly size 28 in this chocolate brown color. I could not resist. I don't have a shade like this in my collection. Look at this bag. I think it'll go and it was so breathtaking. I legit told Caleb how I was looking for a box Kelly before if I ever had the chance to, and it had to check all those boxes with the gold hardware. I think this combination is amazing. The gold with the chocolate brown, it's so pretty. Look at that. And the year of this was 1981. I was born in 1980, so it's pretty much similar age as me. <laughs> Just love this one and look at that I like I said gonna take it for authentication I'm gonna get some of the accessories on it from Redelux I paid 8600 for this it was just one of those bags that it was vintage checked all those boxes I was looking for so long story short I did want to say my box Kelly um, I really just think they're so beautiful. The the sheen on the leather, it's so beautiful. And I, I, I'm just getting lost in the beauty of this, the chocolate brown. I just think this is so pretty. Doesn't it look like, let's just see. Ah, it looks so pretty. It's a nice size. I don't think I would want to go bigger unless that's really the aesthetic, but I, I really do think this 28 size is perfect for the Kelly. Um, in this box, uh, I'm so overwhelmed, guys. <laughs> it's so pretty. Wow, look at this. I love that Kelly buckle. I just, uh, the leather, it's so beautiful. And look at the stitching on this. It's so good. If y'all are wondering, I am still on my Hermes journey with the store downtown, but that takes takes a bit, takes a minute, more than a minute, but it just, uh, yeah. You just don't know when you're a handbag, um, when you're on that journey and you're building that profile, when you're gonna get offered. Whereas this one was just that very special case where was up and I was on the internet and I couldn't believe it was Box Kelly, chocolate brown, gold hardware, excellent condition, and all those things. The box cap is fantastic. That sheen, this is more to me like collector rare piece. I will use this bag, but I certainly was on the hunt. Um, looking for this type of bag if I ever came across it. There was one point when the Real Real, we had a store in downtown Chicago. They had a, they actually had a very similar handbag that I was very much considering, and it was the 28, same 
with the stitching and the gold hardware and it was in that rouge H, the deep red color that one such an iconic shade but they had one it's just that colorway I'm more of a chocolate brown <laughs> obviously so I held off and plus it was just a, a lot of money and it's just something that if you're gonna spend that much money on it that you want to be sure that you are totally invested in all about that color that shade and I wasn't sure if I could totally pull off that color with my wardrobe and obviously I know my neutrals my browns that's that's my thing so <laughs> I'm just excited so Caleb and Quirky thank you for listening to me and my multiple text messages and um, on this handbag but it's it's certainly a beauty I can't wait to add her to the wall over there ah what do you guys think so I did want to give you guys a quick update on the authentication I went to Baba Baby really easy to do it online and she got back to me the next day so super quick the great news was it came back authentic and you can see I'll put a clip in of it shows up in my email and I did remove some of the more personal information like my last name so next step I'm going to be heading to Hermes to see some of the accessories like the clochette and whatnot and I'll probably keep you guys posted over on Instagram hey guys happy Saturday quick update I just got out of Hermes and they took my bag away they are actually going to send it off to Paris get a new handle deal with some of the scratches um, get the clochette and the keys which is great and it's gonna be a couple months so I'm very excited but they're gonna call me and let me know when it's it's ready so I've only had it for a couple days but there you go let me know your thoughts on this I can't believe I finally have an Hermes bag in my collection uh, did you think I like made a great pick for my adding to this collection um, very it's a very curated collection back here so um, but I think this was you can't go wrong with this whole combination but let me know <laughs> thanks so much guys I really appreciate you guys and I will see you in my next video take care guys.